Pick the final product that you need to make before the finish of your program. This is the first, and is unquestionably the most significant weight reduction tips that I can give you. The explanation behind this is basic, without knowing where you are going you will have an issue arriving. Thus, in the start of your weight reduction venture settle on a choice about precisely what you need to achieve when you arrive at the finish of your health improvement plan. The final product that I needed to create toward the finish of my get healthy plan was this, a slender, sound body with 10% muscle to fat ratio and obvious well-defined abs. Considering that in 1994 my all-out body weight was 285 pounds and my muscle versus fat was over 44%, to be completely forthright, I didn't figure I could ever arrive at this significant well-being objective that I set for myself. Be that as it may, this is the thing that I genuinely needed, so I composed this objective in my scratch pad, and made my subsequent stride. Track your present conditions by taking a gander at precisely what you have in the present. When you have picked your final product, your following stage toward making perpetual fat misfortune is to look where you are right now corresponding to your essential target. From the five weight reduction tips, this one is significant on the grounds that it can assist you with understanding your beginning stage in your program. For my situation, I gauged myself, and had an accomplished analyzer measure my muscle versus fat ratio. My muscle to fat ratio when I began was 44%. This implies I had 125 pounds of muscle to fat ratio. Clearly this was truly stunning to me, and my certainty went path down in the wake of hearing this number. In any case, my craving to make my significant well-being objective was extremely solid, so I just composed the amount I gauged, my absolute muscle versus fat weight, and my fit weight at the base of my notepad. I likewise composed the most significant exercises that I gained from 8 years of utilizing low-calorie abstains from food, prevailing fashion eats less carbs, and numerous other weight reduction moves toward that couldn't assist me with creating changeless fat misfortune. Make a rundown of steps that you will take to make perpetual fat misfortune. When you have chosen where you are proceeding to have seen where you are in the current second, your subsequent stage ought to be to make a rundown of the means that you will take to go from where you are today to where you need to be sooner rather than later when you make your ultimate result. From the five weight reduction tips, this third one will assist you with staying concentrated on the following stage that you should take toward your significant well-being objective. Mine was perpetual fat misfortune. This was the essential target that kept me propelled the entire weight reduction period of my program. Considering that I weighed 285 pounds and I needed to arrive at 10% muscle to fat ratio, I determined that I would need to shed 110 pounds of undesirable muscle to fat ratio while keeping up my slender weight. My initial step was to devour my everyday upkeep calorie admission. This implies the calories that originated from my food and refreshments would rise to the sum that my body could practically consume during the day. My subsequent advance included utilizing cardio preparing four times each week. This was significant on the grounds that I realized that to shed 110 pounds of undesirable muscle versus fat I should consume this fat off. Slimming down without practice didn't deliver results before, so I decided to take another way toward making perpetual fat misfortune. My third step was to utilize weight preparing to keep up my slender bulk during the weight reduction period of my program. Since muscle is a metabolically dynamic tissue, our bodies must extend vitality, calories, to look after it, implying that during the weight reduction period of my program, weight preparing would assist me with keeping my digestion raised, and it would be simpler for me to lose the undesirable muscle versus fat. This was a mystery that I gained from my companions in the exercise center, that pre-owned weight preparing to make their strong physical makeups. They disclosed to me that while I am shedding pounds the best methodology is to concentrate on keeping up my present muscle, and when I arrive at my optimal weight I can change my calorie admission and begin constructing new muscle. Utilize a viable sustenance technique to make a little calorie shortage. From the five weight reduction tips, this one can assist you with creating the essential calorie shortfall without you utilizing low calorie or trend eats less carbs. This is significant on the grounds that these ineffectual nourishment techniques lead to an expansion of your hunger and gigantic food desires. Since I definitely realized that a low calorie approach won't work in the long haul and won't help me to make changeless fat misfortune, I decided to expend four normal measured dinners like clockwork. 
The size of every dinner was determined by taking my day-by-day -day support calorie admission and separating this number by four. At that point utilizing the 5030-20 supplement proportion I determined what number of calories I will devour from starches, protein, and dietary fat. Every one of my dinners were made utilizing just common food sources, and the main prepared food that I permitted myself to eat were during the three week after week cheat suppers. These cheat suppers were constantly eaten in the first part of the day, and this helped me to maintain a strategic distance from longings for my preferred nourishments. Another significant component of a powerful sustenance procedure is to drink a lot of water during the day. I determined the measure of water to drink utilizing an equation dependent on my day-by-day -day calorie consumption. Utilize a powerful exercise methodology to consume undesirable muscle versus fat and keep up your muscle. When I began to expend the ideal measure of everyday calories and began to give my body all the large-scale supplements and miniaturized-scale supplements it expected to work appropriately, the vitality level that was created as something that was basically astounding. Doing cardio preparing four times each week was consistently a breeze, and I utilized strolling and a paddling machine to make the essential calorie shortage to consume the most all-out calories during my exercises. Weight preparing was additionally simple, and for the most part since I utilized an extremely basic methodology. I lifted heavier loads with less redundancies. My exercises were consistently 20 to 25 minutes, and a while later I felt truly invigorated. The blend of cardio preparing and weight preparing delivered enchantment. In a year I arrived at my optimal load of 175 pounds and had 10% muscle versus fat. What's more, throughout the previous 15 years I have kept up this perfect body weight by utilizing these equivalent 5 extreme weight reduction tips that I have expounded on. On the off chance that you want to make lasting fat misfortune, you can achieve this well-being objective by making similar strides that I took, and can create a comparable result. Be that as it may, I need to caution you, on the off chance that you need to keep up your optimal load forever, you should continue utilizing these weight reduction tips for an amazing remainder. On the off chance that you stop, in all probability the weight will crawl back on. If you want to learn more about weight loss then please, click the link in the description below this video now.